Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 daily notification video. In this video, I'll cover the Atomic Shop and the daily challenges on, and show you how to complete them at, uh, if I know how to. So let's not waste time and jump right into it. Alright, so uh, I was actually planning to pause these until next Tuesday, but due to some feedback that I received that it show us at least the daily challenges, uh, that's why I'm doing this video. Plus, I'm making here a little test. I played the Nuclear Winter and wanted to see if I'll get the bug and if I will not be able to do the daily challenges, which is uh, not the case here. In terms of the Atomic Shop, uh, as I mentioned, all of the items that I covered on the Tuesday video, um, nothing has changed so far because everything will reset and renew um, this coming Tuesday. Let's hope that we're gonna get something good. So as you can see over here, uh, we don't have that uh, those daily sort of uh, discounts coming. They're all available until next Tuesday. Now in regards to challenges, I did play the Nuclear Winter. As you can hear like some sort of a drum bug noise happening sometimes it triggers that's uh, if you play the nuclear winter first and then you go into the venture mode and I hope Bethesda will fix that thing at some point and these are the daily challenges which are in my opinion are crappy because you can do like 30 atoms no problemo and if you want to get all 50 you gotta do a little bit of grinding so kill uh, liberators five of them I do that in vault 76 and I'll get the 10 atoms, I'll show you how it's done. Level up while, and if you level up while doing any of these uh, sub-challenges over here, you will get additional 10 atoms. So I just leveled up Nuclear Winter and uh, I guess 76, and I wonder why uh, uh, the other thing didn't work. But anyway, so if you level up while uh, Vault in Vault 94, engage in PvP while naked in a group, yielding a protest sign in Death Law Island at the War Park level, under level 30. I don't find like, can you like just just put a location? Was it what? What difference does it make? What level are you? It's stupid. Fast Nash mask, uh, responders gear, Arctos Pharma and under level 20. But there's the come on. It's like most people right now are over these levels, so kind of like a little bit more good stuff. So these level up could be achievable. Like make a add here instead of like the power armor for example it's not listed here but usually it is so it'll, like you know make it a little bit like normal <laughs> I guess but anyway so nuclear winter stay in matches until the end six times this is actually pretty hard <laughs> but doable but pretty hard uh, pick up wildflowers I do that in the uh... man I haven't played adventure mode in a long time White Springs, that's where I do it. Plant crops and camps or workshops, I already did 10 so you don't see me like making those. Just plant one more and I'll get my atoms. And revive a player, this one you'll need a friend to do. So the player falls down, you revive him, done. 10 atoms. So I'm going to start off with uh, building crops. So if you navigate over here and build the crops. If you don't want to scrap or you don't have crops, just go pick up some... Uh, Corn, capture a workshop and blast the workshop with uh, food and you will get your atoms. So the next that I'm going to do is kill the Liberators in Vault 76. So let me show you how it's done. So once you appear in Vault 76, all you got to do is just turn right and run over there. I actually messed up my build because of the nuclear winter. So that's two. That's three, and I need someone to mod my handmade two rifle men. That's four. Or maybe I'm gonna do command. I don't know. Five, six, because I'm planning to redo my build in Nuclear Winter as well. I'm gonna be testing out today the whole stream, uh, a new build. <laughs> Alright, so that's about it, how you do this one, and now let's go and pick up some flowers. Actually, oh, we got a flower right here, pick this up, oh, that's one, and you can hear, still hear those stupid drums. Hey, another one, two. <laughs> Wait, are there a lot of flowers here, no? 
It would be really nice if there would be a lot of flowers here too. You can do like multiple things in one place. Alright, yeah, let's go to White Springs. It's the easiest one. Yeah. I mean, yeah, White Springs. Golf Club. Here we go. So once you come to White Springs, this is where you're gonna spawn in, and you got a whole bunch of flowers here. Bam. Then you got a whole bunch of flowers over there, and if you want to, you can run back, and there's gonna be a whole bunch of flowers over here. As if you don't want to engage with the ghouls. Bam. Simple. <laughs> yep. So that's about it. I'm um, gonna pass out on these two, so today super easy, it's 30 atoms, and uh, nuclear winter is a little bit of a challenge as well. So, c Clay and everybody else, you know the drill, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that like, comment down below, please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered, nobody sees those comments, I read them, but I delete them, have that in mind, so please, no have bombs in the comments. And if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So, hi from Ukraine. I hope you enjoyed this video. Join our Discord if you want to play with us. Uh, currently looking for more players in Nuclear Winter. Currently, I'm actually playing Nuclear Winter a lot more than the Adventure Mode. Actually, I haven't played Adventure Mode in some time now. Maybe I'll resume once uh, the Wastelanders DLC comes. But anyway, this is where I'm going to call it the end for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. You have a good morning, day, and night. Whatever you guys like, it. And I gotta go deal with some cockroaches there freaking attacking my camp. You slimy cockroach. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go. We are the clan, we have a gamer soul.